How to create a simple text sliding animation with Flutter. For creating this text animation, we will use here this Marquee package. Therefore, let's get started by creating a new method, build animated text, where you put then the text inside that should be animated. And now inside of this method, we want to make use of this Marquee package and we put here simply the text inside. Next to it, you can then define first of all the text style, so I make it bigger and I also give it a different color. And secondly, you can also define a blank space and you will later see what it is. So right now our text is here animating and after the last word, which is here this animated word, then the text comes again. And between our text, we have then here some spacing and this is the blank space, which you can provide. So in this case, we have here 30 pixels between it. However, let's put it for example to 90. And now you see we have here every time 90 pixels in space between. To change the text animation speed, you have here this property velocity and by default it is set to 50 pixels. And if you set it for example to 150 pixels, let's hot restart our application then you see that our text is animating more quickly. You could also integrate here some pauses in the text and therefore you have this pause after round property and now I set it here to two seconds. Simply hot restart your application and then we have here every time a two second pause inside when the end of the next round is reached. So this looks then like this. And by the way, you could also animate the text into the other direction if you like. So you could also put here a minus velocity inside. And with this, the text is animating into the other direction. If you don't like that the text is here so close to the edges, simply wrap a container around and set some margin to the left and to the right side. And with this, we have here every time then some spacing on the left and also on the right side. If you supply here for the container also a background color, then you see that our widget is taking here the full size of the screen minus the margin that we have now here specified of 24 pixels. And to change this, you also can simply add here a height of, for example, 80 pixels. And with this, our view is here limited. And this can be important if you want to position this text, for example, to this location here at the top. Therefore, let's change here the position of our text. Instead of this alignment center, we want to set then a margin to the top location and now it is here displayed at the top. And therefore, it is important that you set here the height property around your animated text because if you don't do this, then you see that you cannot change the position of this text. If you liked this video, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel.